This used to be the fourth largest lake in the world. Now it's a desert with rusting ships sitting in the sand hundreds of kilometers from any water. Welcome to the Aral Sea disaster, one of the worst environmental catastrophes in human history. In the 1960s, the Soviet Union decided to divert the two rivers feeding the Aral Sea to irrigate cotton fields in the desert. They called it progress. Within 40 years, the sea lost 90% of its volume, and Tatar fishing towns that once sat on the coastline now sit in the middle of a toxic desert 60 kilometers from the nearest water. The ships that fishermen once used are now rusting monuments in the sand, creating one of the most haunting landscapes on Earth. But the real horror is what it left behind. The dried seabed is covered in salt and toxic chemicals from decades of pesticide use, and massive dust storms now carry these poisons across Central Asia, affecting millions of people. The local climate changed completely. Winters got colder, summers got hotter, and the entire ecosystem collapsed. Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan, countries that used to share this massive lake, now have a coastline with no sea. Some parts of the Aral Sea have been partially restored, but most of it is gone forever. It's a reminder that nature always gets the last word, and you can literally see the mistake from space.